Our world is in peril. Gaia, the spirit of the Earth, can no longer stand the terrible destruction plaguing our planet. She sends five magic rings to five special young people. So James and I were watching Captain Planet today, an old cartoon that I used to watch in the early 90s. When the five powers combine, they summon Earth's greatest champion, Captain Planet. The power is yours! It was just freaky how current the issues were. Ritter, behold the future site of Greenlee's Greenland Estates. The world's most expensive beach resort. <laughs> beach resort? The place is covered with ice, Mr. Greedley. I can make a silk purse out of this sow's ear. Uh, it was almost like a prophetic word from the past. We'll burn all the coal and oil we can find. But we love clean, beautiful West Virginia coal. We love it. Right. Your burning will release tons of carbon dioxide into the air. The sunlight that would normally bounce back into space as heat will be trapped by the increased carbon dioxide. It's like rolling up the windows on a car parked in the sun or like a greenhouse. We know that, Mal. That's why it's called the greenhouse effect. After a few years, this global warming will melt the polar ice raising the sea level all over the world, changing weather, making storms worse. Talking about Greenland being used for um, development. We'll warm up the earth till this place is as hot as the tropics. Oh, I get it. After the ice melts, you can sell your land for a fortune, boss. And, uh, yeah, oh my yeah. gosh, I was like, what the heck? This is Captain Planet, a TV show. President Trump in the last week just been talking about buying Greenland to use it because the ice caps are melting. The land of ice is fast becoming the land of opportunity. Global warming is melting Greenland, exposing the rocks beneath and attracting speculators. Essentially it's a large real estate deal. A lot of things could be done. Ice has little value, but the land and sea beneath could bring riches. This climate change situation is crazy. The future is only a possibility until you make it happen. We all have to be like the planeteers to work together to save our planet. We have to do something. So James and I are doing something. Hey guys, you're back with my James and my dad from Healthy Show. Today we are going to be helping the environment. The environment is not in a good state, so we're wanting to help the environment by planting more trees. And you know what? To go buy trees costs money. And we figured we don't actually need to buy trees. We can take the seeds from trees, can't we? We're gonna plant more gum trees. Yep, we're gonna plant more gum trees all around the joint. We're gonna grow them as seedlings, and then we're just gonna go and start planting them. What do you reckon? <laughs> Captain Planet. The power is yours! James, we have come to one of the oldest trees on the Bellarine Peninsula and what we're going to do is cultivate the seeds from this tree to grow new ones. And see, so you got all these seed pods here, James? See that? We've got all those seeds there. So they'll, they'll be, they're like all brand new trees. So we'll just take some of these. We'll get, get all the, all the seeds from this, this tree. See, we got on, that's every one of those pods has like stacks of seeds in and every one of those seeds will become a tree like this. We come to the ranch just to go to the recycle bin. Let's have a look in here. Plastic bottle, we can use that. Oh, Coke bottle, we can use that. Raspberry soft drink, we can cut that up. Another one. And here's another one. Here's the bottom of the milk jug. Okay, that's enough to get going. So now we're gonna cut off the bottoms of these bottles. And then we're going to put some soil inside it. And then we're going to start okay. put the seeds so in. So where are we going now? Don't go get scissors. Put it, we got to go get some soil to go in there. Yeah, from where though? So the chicken pen soil is really rich. We'll just dig. This is going to be such good soil. There you go. Okay, just put that in, showing you how simple it is. 
So the chickens have fertilized all the soil here. Thank you. Thank you, Chooks. Okay, let's go put some seeds in it. It's the easiest thing and it's just great. Look, James and I are doing a fun family thing together. It's so simple. Spending time with him. We're doing something meaningful, changing the world. He's gonna love it. Like he's just a little legend, James, and he's changing the world. Seeds into it. Okay, now you put the water in it. The seeds will make the trees, the seeds will fall of that, and then we, the seeds from that tree will come to make them all. Yeah, perfect. Using what we have creatively, we have not spent any extra money to do this. If we all planted trees and helped the environment, the environment will turn great. Yeah, so if you want to get some seeds, bust them open like we have. You probably it's probably better to dry them out and let them dry and pop open. But we're gonna try it like just like this. We wanted to see how simple it could be to start a forest. So um we can all do it. It costs nothing. We don't need to go and buy trees. We can all cultivate it. And you're getting out in the garden and doing it and using leftover waste to do it is great. Look at this, James. You're a legend. What a legend. It's got more coming. So good. So, yeah, stay tuned. In our next episode, we'll show you how they're growing. Bye.